Hi, and welcome back to this video brought to you by Maths From Scratch. This is the answer walkthrough video for short division level three. So here are your quick answers. So the answer to the first one is 105. The answer to number two is 2054. The answer to number three is 10,070. And then the answer to number four is 10,809. Now, well done if you've got all those right. You can go ahead and watch short division level four and build up your skills. Or if you've made a little mistake, keep watching and I'm going to go through and answer all these four questions now. Okay, so you've kept watching, so let's go through each question in turn. So the first one, we're going to do our line and our curly brace, as always, and then we write our numbers underneath, making sure to leave a space in between so we can do our carrying if we need to. And we're going to divide that number by two. So then let's take each digit in turn. How many twos go into two? And the answer is one. So we write one above there. How many twos go into one? Well, it's too big, so no two goes in. So we'll just put a zero. Then we strike out the one and carry it. So now remember, how many twos go into ten? Well, we're reading this as a ten now. And there's five twos that go into ten, because two times five is ten. And then we'll put a five above there. And so that's where we get our answer, 105 is our answer to 210 divided by 2. If you've made a mistake, it's more than likely to have gone wrong with your carrying. So that's that one done. Okay, example number 2, or practice question number 2. So our line and our curly brace. And then 4, 1, or 8 underneath. Again, making sure to leave, leave our gaps for our carrying. 2's into 4, well that goes in twice. 2's into 1, it doesn't go. So we put a 0, and again we're carrying this 1. How many 2's going to 10? That's 5. And then how many 2's going to 8? That's 4. So that's practice question number 2 done. Number 3, slightly longer example now. So leaving some space. And it's good to practice this as a habit so you know that you're going to do this in your exam when you're under pressure a little bit. How many three is going to three? Well, that's one. How many three is going to zero? None. And we got that from short division level two. How many threes going to two? Well, three is too big. So again, it's zero. But in this case, we're now carrying that two and striking that one out. How many three is going to 21? Well, that's seven. Because three sevens are 21. And then the last step, how many three is going to zero? Well, again, none. And like I mentioned in short division level two, it is important that you continue your questions right through to the end. Because I have seen when I'm marking exam papers that they don't bother with this zero. And so they just leave their answers 1007. You need to finish it off. And then last, but by no means least, example number four. So curly brace and line time. Okay, so five, four, making sure I'm leaving space so I can do my carrying if I need to. Then I'm dividing this by five. And then we go through each question in turn. How many fives going to five? Well, that's once. How many fives going to four? Zero, because five is bigger than four. So then we carry that four, remembering to strike. Fives into 40 got eight times, because five times eight is 40. Fives into four, well again, it's too big, so none, we're gonna strike that through and then carry the four again. And then fives into 45, go nine. And so that's practice question number four, thoroughly explained for you. Now, it is important that you get really good at your times tables because if you're having to scratch your head whilst doing these questions to work out these simple times table facts, it really does take a lot of time to answer these short division questions. So it does pay to get really good at your times tables for doing any written method. Um, if you need help with your times tables, it just so happens that there's some times table training videos brought to you by Maths from Scratch. So have a look at those playlists and um, get learning your times tables because that will help you in the long run and it'll help you know when for your exam. Okay, so thanks for watching this answer walkthrough video from Maths from Scratch. You can go ahead and watch short division level four. Thank you for watching.